they go doing me now. I'm still a talk of the town. Running the scissors, I'm poking them down. We turn the spots no frowns. Gang hop out, then we clear them. What's up, y'all? We got a new episode of Talk of the Town. Today we got a special guest, D Rose. Hard getting you here. Type shit. Type shit. <laughs> I'm busting. So, um, tell us a little bit what it's like in Jersey. Uh, the part where I'm from is like you no know, regular hood shit. Like you feel me? Like trenches. Like you feel me? Welfare. All type of regular shit that we've been through. Nothing crazy. Regular shit. So like, was y'all like, cause I know like, when I was talking to people from Memphis, they said they start driving at a young age. Are y'all driving young in Jersey? Yeah, we driving young. Like, uh, yeah. we know we know a lot of like young kids driving right now, probably like 13, 12. Like, 12, it's regular yeah. where we from, like the drive. You gotta know how to drive where we from, kind of. Right. So, are you driving? Yeah, I know how to drive. But you're not a good driver. Nah, I hold, I hold, I hold. I know <laughs> you how to could drive. get away, but whatever. Okay, you could do a little something. something. Mm -hmm. Okay, so tell us the backstory of your name, D Rose. Uh, I got my uh, like fat, free fat boy, fat boy, and uh, fees. I don't know who the other person was, but they get like playing ball. We was playing basketball. I was real good. Mm -hmm. You know, it was like, they was like, yeah, you ball like D Rose or something like that. It was something like that. And I was like, yeah, I'm just wrong with that. Like, my name D Rose. Like, because I know how to dunk. Like, mm -hmm. they don't, a lot of people, well, certain people know I know how to dunk. Mm -hmm. But not everybody know how to dunk. Right. I don't want a lot of people know I know how to dunk. You feel what I'm saying? Well, you just told the whole world, so now they know. Yeah, now they know. <laughs> so, um, so do you feel like if you wasn't doing music, you would have been doing basketball? Yeah, I be I be telling my homies like if I was a six five, we'd be in the league. Like we was getting some money regardless. We was gonna yeah. get some money. So, um, when did you see music as your thing? Uh, probably like 2020. When COVID hit, 2020. Yeah, like 2020. Yeah, like 2020. Whenever COVID was, I knew music was for me. Like, I start rapping. You feel me? The homies was fucking with that shit. Yeah. Okay. What song was everybody fucking with? What song you feel like got you up there, up there? Yeah. Probably Golo Rockstar, like Brothers or some shit. Okay. And how did you know? Like, was everybody playing it? Everybody was talking about it? Like, how you know? Uh, everybody was playing it. Like, like a car job pass playing that shit. Like, Type shit. That shit was like, oh, yeah, that's that right there. <laughs> okay, so like, so do you feel like in Jersey, like, it was real supportive, or you feel like niggas would be listening but not really saying much, or they just yeah, show themselves on the net? Jersey, they be supporting, like, they be supporting, like, it depends on, you feel me? They be supporting me, though, but, mm -hmm. you feel me? You, yeah. Regular shit. Are, are you the youngest? One? Mm -mm, I'm not the youngest. I look like the youngest though, but I ain't the youngest. <laughs> Are you 18? No, I'm 19. Okay. Oh, okay. So yeah, you just look small. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. So when did um, so was your family supportive of music when you was coming up? Uh, let me see. Certain certain members, certain family members, but now, but like today, yeah, everybody supportive. Like today, hell yeah. But back then, not not everybody, but yeah. It wasn't negative though. It wasn't that negative support. It was all good stuff. Okay, so when, so going in the studio, what well, us through your first studio session? I don't even remember. I'm trying to think. Mm, damn, I don't even remember. The first time you ever went to a stool and laid down with some shit? I'm trying to think. It's been that long ago? Was it during COVID or before COVID? I think it was probably before COVID. Before COVID? It's cool if you don't remember. I don't really remember. You don't remember? So, but the first song you put out was, do you remember that one? First song I put out, I yeah. think it was called, uh, it was a it was a phone. Nah, look, see, I don't even think, because the first song, yeah, the first song I ever put out, it was in the studio, it was on the phone. It mm -hmm. was with my best friend, my son, Feezy. You know, uh, we uh, was rapping on the phone and shit, and mm -hmm. then we just dropped that shit on SoundCloud and shit. So they talk about so fees. Y'all was on the phone with each other. Yeah, we but we was on. Um, it was something called like Band Lab or some shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we was vibing on that shit. Uh huh, uh huh. Is fees was he locked up at this time or he was out? Nah, fees out. Wait, fees not nah, fees ain't never even been in jail. Oh, uh, this was just another friend. Mm -hmm. Fat boys locked up. Though. Yeah, fat boys locked up. Yeah. Got it. So, yeah, so that went. So now in Jersey, I got like blog pages just like us. So. So like, do you feel like do you like the blog pages or do you think it's too much? Uh, I don't, I don't, for me, I, I, I fuck with it, like, as long as they ain't put, doing that in no negative way for me, I'm chilling, no problem with it. 
So like, so in, you know, New York has all kinds of beef out here. Is it the same in Jersey? Uh, nah, there's no beef. It's just probably politics, but it ain't no beef. It ain't like how it is out here? No, nah, not really. No, nah, y'all don't really be dissing each other? Uh, Cause I we mean, be talking your shit a little bit. Yeah, we be talking our shit. You feel me? We <laughs> probably it probably be for like a you feel me, but nah, not everybody beef like you know. Yeah. So do you do you ever hear a diss track about you though? Uh, nah, I'm behind them shits. <laughs> so you never heard what about you? Mm -mm. Okay. Okay, so that's good, I guess. So in you, so in Jersey, you know the dance culture is really big out there. But you don't really be dancing. Nah. <laughs> I used to, though. We all used to, though. Like, if you from Jersey, everybody going hit their little balance, you feel me? Everybody going, you feel me? Yeah, that's, yeah. So, like, you know, Bam Man was going to come up in Jersey, and he was, like, I don't want to say bothered, but, like, when Philly started doing hip shit, it was, like, a whole thing. Mm -hmm. Does it bother you that the Philly do the hip shit, and that's the Jersey shit, or, like, what? Mm, nah, not really, you feel me? Hey, I mean, it's a dance movie, you feel me? Everybody just want to dance, for me? Yeah, everybody going to dance. Type shit. So, um, so have you ever worked with any Philly artists, or did they tap mm, in with you? Philly artists, nah. I ain't never worked with no Philly artists yet. I worked with New York before though. Mhm. Mm yeah, I worked with I worked with a couple people though. And I seen when you lost your page again, cause why you why you keep losing your page? I don't know, but <laughs> I don't even know. They hating on me. They be taking all my pages. So, but you back on a new page. But I even seen Lil TJ promoting your new page. Y'all type. Yeah. Yeah, that's bro. Yeah, that's bro. That's big, bro. Yeah. Set. Song, song coming, maybe? Set. Nah, we're going to see something. We're going to see. That's my song. That song. So possibly, possibly. So one thing I can say, though, a lot of a lot of the, um, you know, Jersey doing anything, but you seem the most hardworking. Like, you drop a lot of music. Yeah. Uh, we just be trying to stay consistent, you feel me? Like, you feel me? My manager just be pushing me, like, you feel me? You got to stay consistent. Put out that hard shit, you feel me? Type shit. Yeah, so in 2022, you dropped four projects. Yeah. So you given like real young boy vibes, you just keep dropping. Sad. It's about to be more. Uh, <laughs> it's about to be more? It's about to be more. Yeah, come on, say this we just, year, you just. We just getting too. our shit, to, you feel me? We just trying to get everything back in order first. But it's going to be back like that, so I'll be wanting to put the music up. So you know how some people be like, nah, I want to wait till this song hit this number. You just want to keep giving fans music. Mm -hmm. I just want to keep giving them the music for me. Out of all your tapes that you did drop, though, what's your favorite tape? <sighs> Probably no competition. That's my that's my favorite one. Okay. But but my like I fuck with no competition, but the face of the earth that's my shit too. So I fuck with both. Okay, so you like all your tapes. Yeah. Damn there. <laughs> okay. All right, but like, and also samples seem to be your thing too. Yeah, I be trying to fuck with the samples. I be fuck with the samples. So do you, like, you know that them samples be hard to clear. Yeah, for sure. So it's like, do you have any producer you locking in with or? Uh, I lock in, shout out Sue, Dottie, Q Dobbs, Coda, uh, Lazia. I fuck with a lot of producers, uh, Illy, Swale. They be holding me down with beats and shit. Yeah, samples. I be fucking with the samples. I love samples. Being that like you're so dropping music so much, do you have a certain expectation of a song you drop, or do you feel like you got so much music it don't matter? Mm, no, nah, I don't be tripping about that certain expectation. Like I don't be expecting that. I just be dropping, putting that shit out. Feel me? How do you know when a song is droppable versus we gotta put this in a tuck or how do you, how do you know? Uh, cause I'm gonna be able to feel me like yeah, I'm gonna just know you. I'm cause I be feel me, I be high, so I be feeling that shit. I will be feeling the music. I be like yeah. So you just gotta feel the vibes. Yeah, I just gotta feel the vibes. So like when you're making a song, is it up to you or do you play it for your friends and kind of see what they think or like? Yeah, we all be in the studio and if they fucking with it, I be like yeah. Yeah. And like, do you feel like? You make it. You gonna work on more songs for females? Yeah, hell yeah, for sure. Do you feel you got a female fan base or a guy fan base? I got both. Both. Yeah, yeah. I definitely was in tune with you, and then um, you and Rari Digital, mm -hmm. y'all back to back with it. Say Rari Digital, he shoot my shit. Yeah, that's right. So when did y'all meet? How did y'all lock in? Uh, he was doing a a video giveaway, and he was like, at who at who y'all want me to shoot for free? 
And I got the most ads, and he shot my shit, and he dropped my shit. So. And then y'all was locked in ever since? Word. Okay, so go, growing up in Essex, right? Mm-hmm. So, um, who was, was there any other artists out there? Uh, like rappers when I was growing up? Yeah. Yeah, it was. It was a lot. Like who? Like, shit. They still do music? Yeah. This. Yeah, Some of them, like, washed up, though. I'm about to say, because I don't know that. But it's one, it's one I fuck with, though. I fuck with, I fuck with like, when we was growing up, we was listening to Big Moose and shit, but yeah, uh, everybody else washed up now. Yeah, now nah, I definitely heard of Big Moose, Dado. Those was, like, the ones, the two yeah, Jersey uh, ones Dado, I heard. Yeah. yeah. Word. But you also got collab with LBL. Yeah, that's bro, yeah. He came home, and y'all linked up. Sad. So how was that? Did he? Did he? You been into him? He been into with you? Like what? Uh, we like we knew LBL music, uh, but we didn't really hear like where we was at. But but bro was showing love. Like he, I think he hit me in the DM, mm-hmm. and I was like, oh yeah, like hell yeah. He said like I fuck with bro too. Like yeah, he ever saw a dude. I fuck with LBL. Yeah, that's bro. Who else would be like reaching out to you? Other artists? Uh, not really a lot. I be chilling, you know? I don't really be getting no DMs no more right now. First of all, you your page was mad hard to find before. Yeah. Yeah, it was like MT something, right? Yeah, MTF, yeah. Yeah, I would have never known that. I'm typing in D Rose. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, like, when I was first looking for Jersey artists that I used to see your videos on YouTube, but it was hard to find your Instagram. Mm-hmm, yeah. So now it's like, now it's what? What'd you change it to? Uh, it's underscore S block. D Rose underscore S block. Okay. <laughs> you definitely be represent S Block. Yeah. So, being from S Block, what is it that all y'all have? What What do you want that to be known for? Cause you really pushing that right now. I. I don't know. <laughs> Shit. I don't know. We don't we, we don't we just, like like we just trying to put that good music out, man. I'm trying to, cause we all like where I come from. A lot of us make good music. I'm just trying to push the music for me. Okay. So you're just trying to push the hood type shit. Yeah. Okay, dude, the um the cops be fucking with police. I said the cops be fucking with police. The cops be fucking with artists OD out here. Is it the same in Jersey? Cops be on dick? <sighs> nah, cops don't really be, the cops be on dick. That's everywhere, you feel me? But cops don't really be on our dick. They don't really, they be on our, they be on dick, but they don't be on our dick. Okay. Like, they not walking up patting us and shit like that. But yeah, but y'all can shoot a music video. Yeah, we can shoot a music video. They fuck around, be on some dickhead shit one day. Like, yeah, yeah, I can't shoot right here probably one day, but. I don't be on shit. I'm yeah. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's good. So, um, traveling. Do you feel like you want to start traveling? You be traveling? Uh, I mean, I've been to a couple states here and there. Mm-hmm. But traveling, yeah, I'll fuck with start traveling. Yeah, yeah. Start traveling. Okay, cool. And do you be like watching your numbers? Because in, in New York, I feel like drill artists be like, I got to hit a million. I got to hit a million. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I be watching my numbers. Hell yeah, I be watching my numbers. Does it discourage you if a song doesn't hit a certain number? Nah, that's why I be fake me. Like, if that shit don't hit a number, I'm like, oh, I bet. I'm not doing it. It wasn't the one? Yeah. What do you feel like makes a good song to you? Mm. Probably the flow. Like, my flow, how I'm flowing that shit. And the beat got be crazy. Everything really play a part. So are you you not the only one that rap for me a block, but are you the littest one, I guess? Uh, I mean, yeah, I everybody guess you could say, but everybody was hard too. Cause like, you do songs with them, so like. Yeah, I do songs. We hear yeah. about them. Mm-hmm. So like, um, how do y'all all, I guess, push each other to keep going? Like, what motivates you right now? Shit, we just be telling each other, like, you feel me? Mm-hmm. Like, y'all know what's up. Like, we just got we trying to get out of here. You feel me? They know. Who's someone you feel like that gave you good advice? In your music career so far, uh, probably my probably my manager said my manager and my son Feezy, probably them too. Okay, all right, so that's good. So, is there any? What are we expecting this year? This year, y'all expecting some shit. You feel me? Y'all, better, y'all gonna get that music. So, I'm gonna just get out of music. Another project? Yeah, another project coming soon. Another project coming soon. So you, yeah, you giving us projects this year. Yeah. So, um, I must, we're going to play one more game. I'm going to just ask you some questions to say the first thing that comes to mind. Uh, What's your most used emoji? Mm, red heart. <laughs> okay. Um, at what age do you want to retire? 30. 30? Bro, that's dumb young. <laughs> what? <laughs> Fuck this shit. You want to retire at 30, bro? 
Sure. It could be on. All right. Are you gonna be on some Jay Z shit where you pop out with a verse here and there, or you just know music? Yeah, Some probably more. a verse here and there, but I don't want to rap no more. That shit, uh, that shit really. Uh. So what do you want to do? You want to act? You want to? I want. Yeah, I want to be in some movies, like pocket some shit, or, or like, or like shit. I don't know. Um, probably, you, for me, probably be a businessman or something. Be a shark. Be a shark. <laughs> Yo, I'm dead. I feel like you, but you, man, are you just tired of doing music because you do it so much? It just be just the, do like, I don't freestyle, so it's like the writing. I don't feel like writing, like, and I don't want to freestyle, so you feel me? I don't know. I just don't feel like writing. I mean, writing is just reassuring. It's a good song, no? Yeah. Because niggas be freestyling saying bullshit. Yeah, that's why I want to freestyle. What's your favorite app on your phone? Probably IG. What's your hardest bar? I guess. Mm. What do you feel like it? Mm. I'm trying to think of anything. I said. Uh, I said. Uh, mm, I don't know. I'll be saying a lot of hard shit. All right, I'm going to help you out. What's. You got a good flick. What's the bar you're going to use as a caption? It don't got to be my song, right? No, make it your song. Mm, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna say, we putting switches on back of the wop, my son. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and if it was somebody else's song, it would be what? It'll be uh. I think I just used damn. I just wrote down my note. Damn, it, it was a it's a Rallo lyric though. I forgot. Okay. You fuck with Rallo? Yeah, it's your heart. Bye, bye, bye. Okay, um, what song do you listen to for motivation? Mm, Rebels kick it by Young Boy. <laughs> I fucking am with too. What's the last thing you spent money on? Some za. What's your toxic trait? Mm. Mm -hmm. I'm delusion. In a good way or a bad way? Like you don't see it or like I see it, you see <laughs> me? But I don't know, I'm delusion. Okay. <laughs> Whatever that means. <laughs> okay, what's a trend that you wish didn't exist? Shaking hips. Definitely. Okay, one sentence for your ex. Suck my dick. What's your biggest flex? I'm young and I'm rich. <laughs> and what's the conspiracy theory you think is real? Skip. <laughs> Fun. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, and um, best part of your hometown? Thotties. Jersey bitches is it. I, so, mean, I was gonna be mixing, but I'm not gonna be mixing. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but um, we good. Tell people where to find you. How can they tune in? Uh, shit. Follow me on Gram, Apple Music, Spotify. The camera's right there. Oh, shit. So <laughs> but Apple Music, Spotify. For me, all that shit. The rules underscore S block on the ground. For me.